Hello everyone, this is DE235 and we are playing Sonic Adventure on Xbox Live Arcade. I had originally played this game when it originally came out on the Dreamcast. And I, I played so it recently it and it still holds up today for me. So we're going to start a new one. Getting back into making Let's Plays, since this game is really short, I might as well start with this one. And we're going to start with Sonic the Hedgehog, of course. Also trying this on my new Elgato game capture. Hopefully this turns out well. Oh, and uh, FYI, I will not be talking during cutscenes. I'll try to avoid talking during cutscenes anyway. Oh yeah! This is happening! Huh? What's up? And we begin right away with the boss battle. I like the added touch of those two rings already in his inventory. I like that attention to detail. But we're fighting Chaos Zero. This is like the beginning of the Monster of the Week formula in Sonic games. Mostly 3D games though. But this is a really easy boss fight. You just hit him in the head, you just press A with his new homing attack. And oh wow. I didn't expect him to come down so quickly. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. But yeah, that was easy. Yeah, Sonic has a new homing sack that was introduced in this game to help in the 3D platforming area. And that glowing spot on his head is a very obvious weakness. Come on, you big drip! Where you going? Know nothing, fool! It's Chaos, the god of destruction! <laughs> Does this voice sound muffled to you? What can I do with you? Alright, so we're going on our first level. Emerald Coast. Um, I think that model in Tails' airplane is actually different. It's more orange than yellow. Yep. So you have the spin dash, you have the homing attack, and you can collect little animals from the robots that you destroy that can be used for the Chow Garden. 
But uh, just an FYI, this is a live commentary. Depending on what the game is, I may do a live or a post commentary. It depends. But for this one, this is going to be live. I, I know this game very well. I know good points to stop at. I know. I know the chunks. I, I know. I can record it in good chunks. I don't think that's what I wanted to use. And here we have that most iconic memory I have of this game. Which is running away from the killer whale. You know, no matter what I do, Sonic seems to always slow down at that last bit. I don't know why. Now you can explore a bit. The levels are kinda big. Kinda. Since there's multiple characters, you need to cater to them. And one thing that's gonna mess me up here is that you have to use the triggers to turn the camera. Oh well. Okay. I always still feel a little iffy when I'm in tight spaces like this. Or when the camera suddenly changes on me and I'm trying to homie attack something. Now, here's something that I don't see talked about often enough. When you get to certain sections of a level in Sonic stages, the music changes. I think that's being true to the classic versions where you reach a new stage or a second part of a stage and the music changes. I think that's a nice touch. This is more of a classic Sonic game brought into life in the 3D. That's what I think of this game as, anyway. While I can't say that I particularly like the classic series, I haven't finished one, I haven't finished any of them, but I've played them a lot. I need to try and finish those games, at least, so I can get my full opinion on them, but... This one, this is what made me like video games, is playing Sonic Adventure. The original Dreamcast. I can barely remember the Dreamcast since it was there for such a short time. But what I do remember it, I mostly remember Sonic Adventure 1 and 2. Those are the only two games I can remember from it. A few others here and there, but... Other than that... Just this one. And its sequel. Which is unfortunate. There's a lot of great games there I would like to play. Long time no see, huh? I'm just glad you're okay. What happened anyway? You're too good of a pilot to just crash like that. That was a test run using a new prototype propulsion system. It's got a few bugs to iron out. Why not just use my plane, the Tornado? Thanks, but you gotta check out my newest power supply. Ta-da! Whoa! A Chaos Emerald! Yep, I just happened to find one of the seven emeralds during one of my test flights. This thing's got unlimited power, you know. So I figured, why not use it to power my plane? Supercharge! You gotta come over to my workshop, Sonic. I've got something I've gotta show you. It's in the Mystic Ruins. The fastest way is by train. Let's go! You think the fastest way would be by foot, since Sonic can run so fast. Oh well. And I'll talk about the voice acting later. But until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye!